It's a fire song by Lato and it's called Put It On The Floor right here on Trace of M first with a hit. Good afternoon, good afternoon. I told you I keep my promises. I'm in the studio with the founder of a luxury hair vendor and salon. She goes by the name of Mediger. Hello. And uh, the salon mm-hmm. and vendor to luxury hair is called Mediger London Hair. That's right, a.k.a. MLH. A.K.A. MLH. Yes. M-L-H. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> Welcome to Trace. It's a pleasure Thank having you. you here. Thank you for having me, Jojo. You look amazing. Your Thank hair you. definitely is amazing. What else do you expect from MLH hair? Nothing less. <laughs> so have you always thought of venturing into luxury hair or how did this come to be? No, I never thought I would be into hair. Wow. My background is in sales and marketing. Oh, okay. Completely different. <laughs> How did this come to happen? <laughs> so it came to, it was just me and uh, my business partner, Rookie Pew, having some fun. Yeah. Uh, it kind of started with just, okay, I started with my spa, which uh-huh. is known as Luxury Body Spa. Yes. Then being in Kenya now, at the time, I think I was about 18 months in. Mm-hmm. from London yeah. and I was I came I was excited doing braids 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 then I was like oh, I want to do a wig now yeah. so I started searching for wigs here I couldn't really find anything at the time to kind of match my taste so I said oh I'll just get a wig from London when I go Yeah. so when I came back um, I bought some nice wigs a friend of mine makes wigs in London mm-hmm. then um, my clients from the spa started to see me with wigs they were like oh this wig looks nice it's not from me doesn't looks a bit different I was like yeah yeah I got it from London one of my friends does the wigs so I just thought hmm me and my business head yeah. <laughs> this is an opportunity the sales in you exactly <laughs> I was like let me just start getting a few in for my clients yeah and then before you know it word spread clients then I started working with influencers that already were influencing for us for my spa then yeah just started getting round and then here I am. Do you have the same business in the UK in London? Um, No, not anymore. Actually, Mm -hmm. MLH is originally a clothing brand. That's what I have in the UK. That's what people don't know. What? Yes. (laughs) (laughs) So originally that's what I actually planned to bring. Yeah. But then this just took over. Then I stopped that clothing brand then with the hair and now the clothing brand is actually coming in that's where my passion is uh, with clothes interesting so when it comes to luxury hair of course um, just take us through the value chain like where do you get it from well before you used to get it from London and bring it here right yeah yeah and um, most um, it still is from London and bring it here (laughs) so uh, example Zuri I know someone who's called Zuri they Mm -hmm. get um, a lot of hair from different places and they Mm -hmm. have a manufacturing place in China where they do quality control so do you do that in London or how do you the quality control actually starts my hair now we've recently changed to complete raw hair Um, so it comes from Vietnam then everything gets customized from London Mm. then we bring it here so that's the quality control yeah Um, so that's why even when clients come they're like can you make me a wig with this I can't everything is from London so if it's not available it means that you have to pre-order to be custom made yeah yeah well interesting what we'll just say are some of the challenges you face because when it comes to luxury hair and the Mm -hmm. clients customers you have to be very good and on point what are some of the challenges you'd say you go through um the challenges i go through is i was quite surprised how much people don't know the difference between even laces there's different type of laces you have swiss lace french lace and all lifestyles hd lace mm. um and the, explaining the different type of hair you have virgin you have brazilian you have indian you have raw so that's the first challenge is what's the difference right yeah so i think what i was good at is instead of t- explaining it to you because it's very hard to understand yeah i showed you mm. right yeah i got you a bad lace or what we call a transparent lace yeah then you have my hd so what i normally do to the client is can you see this can you see this what's the difference this is much much more seamless this is very clear this one is hard lace and this lace is actually a different color it's black yours is actually lace see-through yeah and that's it so I think I've kind of shown people instead of telling them 
um, it's like a, I always tell a story even when I post yeah. I think it even started with luxury body spa mm. I just think if you're going to um, if I'm going to come and spend when I go to a shop I always think of what would I ask or what would I want to mm. expect from that yeah. vendor or whatever shop mm-hmm. so when I'm creating a product or selling a product I think of it as if it was in my shoes yeah. what would I expect especially when it's not the cheapest hair but it's not the most expensive so I want it to be always money worth spent and that's why I say it's not just hair it's an experience I want you to get an experience I want you to learn something from me so next time even if you're going to buy hair from somebody else even if it's not myself you know the right questions you know how to spend your money interesting yeah so uh, this has forced you to learn and know a lot about laces and all the yeah exactly it's pushed me (laughs) I'm like all I talk breeds literally everything is here in my life yeah so yeah but I love what I do I think I enjoy the sales and marketing part of, uh, of this than anything well it tells why it's a success right <laughs> so it's good you've Hope mentioned so. laces and all that could you tell us what mm-hmm. um, Mediger London hair specializes in mostly so we specialize in hair extensions wigs some people know and uh After the hair, I launched my own hair products specifically for the wigs. Uh, it's MLH installation kit. So I have MLH uh, glue, melting spray, glue remover, um, lace cleaner, everything to do with wigs I have yeah. for you. Um, again, the first in East Africa. Nobody had that. Mm. Because I'm like, well, if I want you to wear this hair flawlessly and represent me even after leaving a millage salon yeah i need you to continue with this product and for you to maintain this for longevity i need you to continue with these products and that's how you do it so we specialize in yeah wigs and of course products and also installation so we can actually install wigs for you style for you and so on there's so much more being added i have a someone who's called michael he's telling me to ask you Ooh, what's michael. the difference between human hair and luxury hair like what can they get for their wife oh the wife <laughs> well tell your wife to come to mlh first <laughs> michael so human hair um there's different types of human hair because luxury hair is still human it's just the type of human hair it is mm-hmm. so i've recently just switched to raw hair so human hair is processed it's been processed with some chemicals it's cut from uh, a donator's head process with some chemicals maybe make it more um european maybe more brazilian it's kind of uh, change textures mm-hmm. and then you have raw hair just straight up cut from the donator's head and then put into a, a weave strand yeah. and that's my hair it's the top quality hair you're going to get and that's what makes me different i had he, I, i do still sell virgin but now to make it even more luxurious a step further i've decided to switch to oral hair yeah. and i hope michael has gotten an answer because i didn't know some of that yes where can michael come michael can come to mlh studio uh it's in ad life plaza in kilimani opposite um yaya center also michael can follow us on social media which is midiga london hair you can dm us with any inquiry we also have all our contact details on our bio i'm with an amazing lady who goes by the name of mediga i'm very sure i am killing that name <laughs> <laughs> no doing it just right you said it just perfect mediga yeah yes founder of mediga london hair right yeah. and um i have esther asking um she's from uganda is it possible Hi, to still sorry is mm-hmm. it possible for her to still get hair in order for it to go to uganda yes through the very social much media possible. yes 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 and i'm about to talk, talk about that yeah in, in a bit next, stay tuned as that oh, you're about right. to find out how you're about to get that hair anywhere <laughs> now um the hair business in africa of course is starting to spread and we can yeah. see a lot of companies in regions like america and uh, europe mm-hmm. gaining some interest when it comes to the african market like they can see there's a new market in africa for this right now your company has been here you've told me three years but i've been here for three years yeah yeah um but of the last 18 months 18 I've months been, yeah a year and a half yeah, yeah and you're setting the pace just like that i hope so oh my <laughs> goodness 
So what would you say <clears throat> makes you stand out most because already you've set the standard. Yeah. What makes you stand out as you do? Um I, just like I said in the beginning I think it's how I was able to showcase uh my hair. I take you through a journey as soon as you come in. Um it's not just again telling you this will look great or this it's 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 an experience uh the way I've been able to the way I've been I think I've been able to show people that this levels to hair yeah. wigs yeah uh, more easier I think mm. from what I've I'm getting the feedback that I'm getting from clients yeah. and uh colleagues it's it's different uh it's a package it's not just hair it's coming with also you know makeup when you're there you do my hair you get a little photo shoots you know mix you at that moment everybody wants to feel like the influencer celebrities that they see there that's true and uh i think what i've been able to do well is not making anybody feel lower oh because i'm not a celebrity maybe she won't do this for me i treat everybody the same every client des- deserves the same treatment uh as my influencer celebrities but um i think that's what's made me different is how I was able to showcase and people can now see this different type of laces just like you said you didn't even know yeah this does look different people can now see that that's not a good wig that's a good wig yeah that's a hd lace that's a transparent lace that's also something i wanted to mention i think yeah. you give people what you say you have because yeah. some people will say this is the best but <clears throat> after a couple of months it's really yeah. not the best yeah. but you have a whole experience yeah. for your clients and customers yeah yeah i give you value for your money basically True. whatever it costs it will feel like it costs that much <laughs> now in a year yeah and a half Mhm as I've said you've set the standard and I feel like you have a lot more for us coming <laughs> you do I feel you know my instincts are right my mm-hmm. instincts are right <laughs> what is that jojo what do you think i have coming <laughs> you might open a branch in um, kinshasa i Ooh. had they they love luxury here who knows where else <laughs> mm, jojo have you been a fly in my wall <laughs> maybe so what's the plan Um the next plan is we're now launching MLH app. Mm. That's the plan. So again, over the past 18 months, I've been getting a lot of inquiries from pretty much everywhere. Um hi, where can I see more of your products? Where can I order? I'm in South Africa, I'm in Tanzania, just like uh was it Esther from Uganda? Yes. yes. Wants to order my wig. Where can I see? Where can I see your prices? So instead of just an old boring website yeah me complicating my life <laughs> <laughs> decided i don't want to do a website mm. i want to create an app okay so the app aims to have all my uh, hair products as well and uh, with a good incentive right mm-hmm. so if you subscribe to the app the app will give you 25% off on all hair of Ooh. your choice Ooh. and 10% on all products right yeah right you subscribe to the app and you also get to see exclusive content from MLH mm-hmm. um but what i also decided to add on the app i decided to not just single out of what I, what i wanted was to create a community an online community with other salons yeah So in this app there's a feature where I'll add other salons mm-hmm. that you'd be able to see. So these salons are from different regions? Different regions in Kenya. Um just a quick example, you know, I want to do my hair I'm from London, I don't know Kenya. Yeah. Um so I need to do my hair and I didn't get a chance to do my hair, mm. right? So instead of just saying oh MLH MLH, right? You'd be able to go to the app uh type the area that you're staying in and a drop down list of all the salons within that area will come up and you get to choose. Oh wow. Right? Yeah. So it's actually also more like kind of like a marketplace for other salons to also be seen. Yeah. My page reaches a good a number at the moment is averaging 500,000 per month on social media only. Yeah. Right? Mm-hmm. So I'm also want to work with these salons so I want to create that community, that relationship. We can all be in the same industry and all be successful at the same time 
if we just all work together so it's literally for everybody these salons will be able to also market their brands their salons in my um app um and get my products as well for cheaper um so amazing amazing stuff i don't want to say too much because i need them to download the app yeah <laughs> but that's another feature there but um yeah the mla shop i'm so excited about it the, the plans that we have it's bigger than just kenya yeah um like you said there's the ugandan there's tanzania everybody does hair from kids to mm, women to yeah, men that's true so, yeah so um i'm pretty <clears throat> sure we have a couple of salon on owners across east africa yeah so what does it take for them to get to have their salon in the app it, just to subscribe Oh, that's nothing else to just subscribe let me do that part the oh. tech uh, we, we've got a great team that we've put together of uh, the tech that will be running the app specifically then we've separated that I'll do the content creation making sure everybody's on there everybody's getting the service that they paid for the subscribe for shall I say so all you have to do is subscribe once you subscribe you'll that's be it. able to know everything you're about already the app, in the list on there. you're on the list exactly uh, that's, that's all you have to do yeah Have we launched the app? We're launching on the 24th Ooh. of August this that, Thursday. That's I'm the day so after tomorrow. Excited. That's the day after tomorrow. Are you the anxious? Countdowns. Are you I nervous? Am, I'm nervous, of course. It's, it's normal to be nervous. Yeah. Uh, because this is probably the biggest thing I've done. Mm. From the clothing brand, of course, to the spa to now this. But... um. Well, they say if you're not if your dreams don't scare you, not dreaming big That's enough, true. right? So That's true. Yeah, I'm nervous, but no, I'm very confident it's going to go well. I've got such a, an amazing team, so who's been helping out from my uh, business partner Rookie Bu to the influencers, I really appreciate them. I know with them it's all going to be good. Congratulations. Thank That's you. That's a big step. Thank you. I told you I can see you going far. Oh, thank you, Jojo. I think the Kinshasa part was a bit off, but <laughs> <laughs> Oh, we'll get there. Off. No, no, no. You see, you might just manifest it. You manifested on my behalf. It's been a pleasure having you here. Thank Any you. last words you'd like to tell guys what yes. listening to you? Yes. Guys, right now? I need you guys to put a reminder on your phone 24th of August from 6 p.m. the app goes live. Oh. There is 25% on all wigs, 10% on products. If you ever wanted an MLH hair and that that time you couldn't afford it, this, this is, is your time. time. <laughs> <laughs> this is your time to join MLH app, to be a part of the community, to all the salons. Look, I have some amazing stuff on there that will benefit all of you guys. Contact MLH Medigal London Hair online yeah. on Instagram. If you want to speak to me directly, the numbers on the bio, I'm the one who runs everything on that um app at the moment Ooh. Instagram so be able to ask any questions about the app what's in store for you guys whether you're a salon or an individual and we deliver worldwide period period wait wait how do you handle all these things you're doing I know superwoman <laughs> Yo, I just ha- I'm the one who handles every I'm like what yeah, I stay on top but that's how I make sure I keep my name clean there yeah exactly oh, it's been a pleasure having <laughs> you here thank you for here. having me guys love 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 thank you Trace TV thank you It's Jojo for having me thank you and You're I can't welcome. wait to see you on Thursday see you on Thursday alright so please follow the social media pages mm-hmm. and on Thursday at 6pm the app is going live please make sure to subscribe right yes subscribe subscribe amazing stuff and guys like mike you've had where all the juice is at mm-hmm. and the pale what's the plaza again adlife plaza mm-hmm. in kilimani opposite yaya center mm-hmm. and the map google map is on the bio too so yeah you can like, also uh, get some makeup for her not just the hair like exactly and actually download the app Mike, don't even need to Six come there anymore. There. Just download it. <laughs> thank you, Medigar. No, thank you for having me, guys. My radio station. Trace. Instrumenta. Clean. Sound.